Will we see a surge of home buyers moving to the suburbs? Hi, I'm Scott Neal, the broker of Scott Neal Real Estate in Richardson, Texas, and we help people buy and sell residential real estate in and around the Dallas-Fort Worth area. And recent data is showing that a trend from urban living to suburban and even rural living is picking up right now. Of course, that has to do with the pandemic. And as more and more people are looking for extra space and dreaming of owning a home, and with more working from home opportunities, we are seeing these trends pick up. But the question is, will this trend continue? According to recent data from Zillow, there is a current surge in urban high-end listings in some larger metro areas. The month-over-month -month increase in these homes going on the market indicates more urban homeowners may be ready to make a move out of the city, particularly at the upper end of the market. So why are people starting to move out of the cities? Well, obviously the pandemic and the health crisis is spurring people to really change a lot of their plans right now. However, a July report from Homelight showed that people are really looking for four things. One is they'd like more interior space. Number two, they have a desire to own rather than rent. Number three, they'd like to move from the city to the suburbs. And number four, they'd like more outdoor space. So more space, the proximity to fewer people, and just a desire to own at a more affordable price point are pushing people out of the urban areas and into the suburbs. And according to John Burns Consulting, the trend is accelerating faster than anyone could have predicted, and the need for more space is really driving this suburban migration. Additionally, Cheryl Palmer, who's the CEO of Taylor Morrison, which is a home building company, uh, she says that most recently, we're really seeing a pickup in folks saying that they want more rural or suburban locations. Initially, there was a lot of talk about that, but it's really coming through their buyers today. The National Association of Home Builders also shares that new home demand is improving in lower density markets, including small metro areas as people seek out larger homes and anticipate more flexibility with their work, working from home, so the flights to the suburbs is real. Will this shift pick up speed and continue on? Well, right now we don't really know. And so some experts like Lawrence Jung, who is the chief economist at the National Association of Realtors, is tapping the brakes a little bit, seeing that this certainly is a trend, but we need some more data to know how long that this is really going to last. And so Jung notes that home buyers considering a move to the suburbs is a growing possibility after a decade of urban downtown revival and greater work from home options and flexibility will likely remain beyond the virus and any forthcoming vaccine. So while this trend is happening, especially during the health crisis, we will have to wait and see uh, until we get a little bit more data to know whether this is going to be an ongoing trend of people moving out of the urban areas and into the suburban areas. So bottom line is, while this is still a growing trend, we'll have to wait and see how this is going to play out long term. But if you are one of those urban dwellers Maybe you're renting downtown and you're starting a family and you'd like to get out into the suburban areas. We'd like to talk with you and we'd like to show you how affordable it can be to move out of those urban areas. So give us a call at our office. Our number is 469-998-3322. Visit us on our website at mydallashomefinder.com where you can see all of the MLS listings and you can also get signed up to our private off-market database. So, we hope that you're staying safe out there, and if you're thinking about making a move, you got to give us a call. So thank you, and happy selling.